Hey, what's up everyone? My name is Tango230. I hope you guys are having a great day. So welcome to The Thing. This game is a sequel to the 1982 classic by John Carpenter, starring Kurt Russell. And on a side note, if you guys haven't seen it, definitely go watch it because it is, still holds up really well today. And uh, if you guys haven't seen the 2011 prequel starring Mary Elizabeth Winstead, also known as just The Thing, definitely watch that too because it leads up to the 1982 classic really well so without further ado let's play the thing so i should mention it's gonna get dark in here Larson! Larson! also there aren't any subtitles in the options Oh my god. Creepy laughter. Check. Blake, it's Whitley. What's the situation? Not good. What do you see? Not a goddamn thing in this storm. Have you found anything? Well, your transmitter's down and everything else is foobar. What do you mean? The base is gone, Colonel. It looks like massive explosives damage. Any clues here are gonna be like finding a needle in a haystack. Understood. Do a recon, see if you can find anything that'll give us an idea what happened. I could try to get the chopper back to you within an hour, but visibility's falling fast and the report for your area is not very good. Okay. We'll make a sweep and report back. Roger. Meanwhile, I'll check up on Alpha Team. Oh, Blake. Just remember it's 40 below out there. We both know exposure could sneak up on you. Keep your team together and get them to shelter as quickly as you can. Roger that. Blake Roger out. That. Cool, okay, so my name's Blake. And uh, oh, book tutorials. As you play through the first four levels, text pop-ups like this, a tutorial for a tutorial, cool. So uh, they're just telling me there's gonna be pop-ups, so go back and cold exposure. Uh, let me read this real quick and I'll summarize everything. Right, so what this essentially means is you can't stay out in the cold for too long because there's a health bar. Actually, there is a uh, oh, exposure meter that turns blue. Just like that. It just flashed, but you didn't. You barely saw it. And uh, objectives are green. The ones that are finished go orange. Alright, so there is the exposure meter. Retrieve evidence and rescue any survivors. Keep team alive. Alright, so when I first tested this out the right stick was actually the movement and the left stick was the aim which was really weird so let's head inside so we don't freeze our asses off okay that is barred in so let's open this hearing creepy noises everything is messed up okay cutscene awesome blake you need anything repaired or even a simple bypass and i'm your man if any of you take on any damage, get back to me ASAP, and I'll help you out. I'm not carrying any dead bodies back. I'm locked, loaded, and ready to make shit dead. <laughs> Sounds good. Alright, so squad. Okay, so in the squad I have the engineer, I have the medic, and pretty much the soldier. So I can tell them apart based on what they're wearing, hat-wise. And I can interact with the team by pressing the Y button. Okay, sounds good. Uh, there's also squad member trust. Right, so it seems like the actions I do, um, they'll either trust me or distrust me, and there will be a trust meter in the squad menu. Alright, so like this. I don't know where the trust meter is here, but uh, it seems like everybody's okay, except for Weldon. I don't know why he's red. Uh, they seem pretty chill right now, so... Uh... Alright, so let's explore a little bit. And... Wow. Right, there is a hole in that wall. Seems like the table kind of busted through it so there's some blood down here and 
what's over here? Oh, yeah, uh, basic junction boxes. Whenever you see a hand icon, it means you can interact with it. So uh, let's head up to it. And you have to hold B. So I don't think I need the engineer for this one. Let's open this. That closes the door, I believe. Yes, it does. I'm going to head inside and uh, get blown up because the computer blew up. So my medic, he pretty much heals me if I'm in the vicinity. And it says the medic cannot heal himself. So I have, I have to do it myself. So let's uh, get this. B to pick up everything. Got some ammo. Got a pistol. We got some more ammo for this gun. Just pick it all up. All right. So because I'm injured, hold still and I'll fix you up. He'll heal me. Area cool. looks secure. All right. So we're good to go. Uh, nothing else is here. So let's head outside. Back out to the hallway where the explosion happens. Cool. I think, I think when I turn that on, it's like I blew out the rest of the fuses in the, in the building. All right. So oh, I remember the pool room in the original. All right, so we got some explosive barrels here. I wonder what they're used for. Let's head over here. This is... I don't remember that room. Recreation room, possibly? I don't remember the entire layout of the base. What the hell? Okay, then. So I did rewatch the original just so I can get caught up on the events here. There's a door. Locked doors. Not all doors will require you to fix a junction box. Some of them need a key. Okay. So, I need to find the key to gain access to the infirmary past this crashed helicopter. So let's follow the light and see if there's anything over here. Gotta stay out of the cold, but so far, the cold meter is still pretty high up. What's over here? It's a shack. Eh? What's that? I'm gonna hide this tape when I'm finished. If none of us make it, at least there'll be some kind of a record. The storm's been hitting us pretty hard now for 48 hours. We still have nothing to go on. One other thing. I think it rips through your clothes when it takes you over. Windows found some shredded long johns, but the name tag was missing. Ugh. They could be anybody's. We're all very tired. There's nothing else I can do. Just wait. R.J. McCready, helicopter pilot, U.S. Outpost North 31. So that was the message he left in the, uh, in the original movie. Alright, so the key must be here somewhere. Seems like since I was inside, I wasn't exposed to the cold, so that's a good thing. So, oh, look, what's this? Is that a flare? I wonder if that was part of the tutorial I missed, but, uh, that's fine. I'll figure it out. Just pause the game and look at the controls anyway. Seems like I'm full up on this. Let's head over. Wait, what's over there? What is this? Whoa, okay. Creepy music bound. Also, it's cool I can see my footprints and stuff over here. What is over here? Fire extinguisher. What am I gonna need that for? Oh, this is the that UFO thing, the, the saucer. What the hell? What do you think it is, Captain? I don't know, and I don't care. Looks like a goddamn UFO to me. This shit gives me the creeps. Yeah, yeah, we're not alone in the universe and all that crap. Check it out and move on. All right. Oh, okay, good camera. Check it out. What's here? Oh, there's the key. All right, cool. So I can get to the infirmary now. I don't think there's anything around here. Except for places where I can bang my head over there. All right, so uh, let's head back to the infirmary. What? What the heck? Well, the camera's weird on that angle. It's trying to be like Silent Hill, but I don't know what's going on. Hey, look. It's one of those bulldozer trucks that they used. Should be open now. Cool. Gain access to the infirmary completed. It's over here. Advanced junction box. Oh, this is where I need to use the engineer. So he can fix it if he's close up. So uh, where are you? 
There you go. Now I can press B. Uh, B when the hand icon shows up. I need an engineer. Okay, okay there he goes. Nice. Why are you guys standing outside? Come inside. It's uh, cold out there. Alright, we got the lights on now. And we got the blood. Is this where the... Is this where the thing ate that guy? Or, is that, or was that a different room? I don't know. Let's check it out. What's this? What is that? Adrenaline hypos. Uh, oh, if they're suffering extreme stress, I can use it on them. Press the black button. I don't have the black button. I'm using the 360 controller. Uh, I'm going to have to figure out which button that is. I'm going to have to calm them down. I feel like I need to calm down somebody because since they gave me the hypo. And... Okay. Ah, oh, Christ, what is that? Okay, he's freaked out. Ooh, that's horrible. Chill out. Everybody keep tight till we figure out what's going on. All right, medic. You probably haven't seen worse. Squad member Fear. He's scared, so what I need to do usually is give him a gun so he'll feel like he can protect himself. Or I just got to get him away from this horrible, horrible area. But I can't do that right now. I'm using Peter. And I've compiled a five-page report from the autopsy, and there's a code to the door, which is one one three eight. That's the kind of so, information come on, let's get out of here. talking about. Let's get out of here, man. No, you're good. See, Walden's shaking. He doesn't like it. So let's go. Come on, let's leave. Walden, Walden, come on, dude. All right, I'm okay. Good. Okay, so he's shaking less now, but he still, he still looks a little stressed out. Access code doors. Okay, I already got the key. So, let's open it. And this is the cl oh, cool. I guess I'm, uh, nope, what are we doing? No, no, I fired a gun. That was stupid. B is to pick up, not A. Oh, my God. How do I aim? Oh, R, uh, RT. So, nice. I can open this myself. <laughs> Even though he got a question mark on it. Like, I can do it for you. And uh, what is this? Oh, saving the game. That's right. And uh, I use audio recorders to save the game, so let us save the game. I think I, sh I think I can play like a little bit more, so let's head outside. Okay, where are we going? Where are we going? Why are we out here? Let's head past... What is this? Can I open this? I can't open this. I don't know what this is. C4 it looks like that got planted. Alright, I guess we're heading past the flares that you can barely see in the dark. And, uh, we're heading to the shack over here. Whitley, this is Blake. What have you got? One body. Identification says childs, no survivors. And what appears to be a... One body? And, 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 and what? And some kind of unidentified craft. It looks... Well, like a, a UFO. Colonel. Uh -oh. Colonel. Roger. I'll have a chopper there ASAP. There's a supply crate that was dropped earlier near the base. It contains C4 charges. I want you to rig all the remaining buildings and I'll remote detonate them from here. Affirmative. I'll contact you when we're finished. And we get to blow shit up. Also, that was Childs. Where's, uh, Kurt, where's McCready? Where's McCready's character? Can I check him out? What is, he doesn't have anything. Oh wow, he's he's gone. All right, so I already collected that. I guess we're just gonna head back to the tape recorder, so we can save our game, and uh, end the episode. And the next one, I'll just blow shit up. So do I have enough? I think that should be enough. I already picked all of them up. All right, so I just saved the game, but uh, I think it's building a lot of tension. This is actually pretty cool. I didn't expect all the uh, squad trust and squad commands so uh, I definitely like that aspect of this game so anyway if you guys made it this far thanks for watching and as always take care and Tinker 230 out alright guys game on everybody let's explore the rooms then because I really want to do that I feel guilty for some reason you sh okay. Alright, let's head to the second floor. Every th the ones that are locked should be all open now. What is that one?